Hi. So in the previous tutorial, we create our services. This. And write a method to enter these values. So I am using this table employee data. As the table name is this and that's it. So let me just change some of the values. So now I'll change some of the values and let me show you some other methods. So now I don't want these. So now we have some methods like get employee, get employee count. So let me just use this and say employee ID this dot get name. So So now we have a method employee local service util dot get employee that fetch the employee of ID two and I just print the name of that employee. So let me just deploy this. So it's deployed successfully. And look, it retrieved the value. This ID. But what if we want to get all the employees whose address are in UK or USA? So like I want to write a query where like select all the employees was addresses USA or India. So how to achieve this in library? Because there is no method that work on this field or we can say this column. So for this we have to write finders. There are other ways also like dynamic queries but finders is the simplest way. So just write a finder on this. So this is our entity. Employee. So this is the finder so like finder name so I want to fetch on the basis of employee address so finder name like and the return type is collection So this must be address because when library generated method for this it also append find by like this so my method is so that's why i keep address a is capital because find by is automatically appended by library so now finder column so on which column its finder is 
appended so finder column is our employee address So that's it. We write finder name, address, and keep A as capital. The written type of is this collection, and finder column is address. So I want to write a finder on this column. So after this, click on overview and click on build services. So when you open this employee persistence MPL, you can see the method find by address. Find by address, which contain three arguments. So they are multiple overloaded method. So our method is created, but we have to expose this in our local service MPL. So open employee local service MPL and write a method in this so that it is available for use. So for this, just write So now our method is complete. So for this, just service build one more time. So that's it. So let's access this method. So now it's available.
and look all from USA is here. So, there are three John and one is Jack and Michael. So, if I change USA to India And look, all employees who live in India are available. So basically, for writing finder method, we write this statement, finder name, return type and finder column and then build the service after building service we mention this method in local service IMPL classes and again build services and that's it your method is available in your controller so that's it for now this is how we can create finder methods in life the finder method is very useful we can also write dynamic queries in later tutorials for this but for now this is sufficient so if you like the video hit the like button share the video and don't forget to subscribe thanks for watching